With an image projected, it is time to make adjustments in order to get the image to fit the board. You can push in or pull out the mount arm in order to get the image size to fit the whiteboard. On the mounting arm, there are markings for setting the length of the arm to achieve the desired image size. Extending the mount arm by sliding it out will allow for a larger image. Shortening the mount arm will reduce the image size. You then need to adjust the roll, pitch, and yaw of the projector to get the image squared. You can get assistance for these adjustments by using the on-screen help inside the projector. Before doing so, you may need to adjust the projector focus so that you can read the instructions clearly. To adjust the focus, we open the latch on the side of the projector where air filters are found and adjust the focus lever by sliding it up or down until the image is in focus. And we close the latch again. With the projector focused, you can now access the on-screen help with the remote by pressing the menu button, followed by settings and installation guide. Once it is displayed, you can use the instructions to adjust the roll, pitch, and yaw. Adjustment dials labeled number one controls the horizontal roll of the projector. Dial number two adjusts the yaw or horizontal keystone. And dials labeled number three adjusts the pitch or vertical keystone. The long adjustment screw can also be used to raise or lower the projector arm as needed. When installed correctly, you should not have to use any digital correction on the projector. It is now time to mount the finger touch unit. Included with the Brightlink projector is a mount for attaching the touch module above the board. If you have determined at the start of the install that you must mount the touch unit on the board, you will not use the touch module mount. For the purpose of our video, we will install the touch unit above the board using the touch module mount. First, separate the two parts of the touch module bracket. Using three screws, attach the L-shaped portion of the bracket to the wall. The center of the bracket should be aligned with the center of the board. Vertically, the mount should be located one to two inches above the top of the projected image. Next, use the three long screws to attach the touch module to the tilt plate of the bracket. 